Enter if you must. So, I was wrong about our thief. It appears so. They say we were careless with our trap, that this is our fault. But even without the Sarkamek, there would have been death. This elf was determined to lay blame at our feet. Selfishness, want, denial. How do you allow this to continue? If you dislike Kirkwall so much, why haven't you left? Since we arrived, I have seen nothing but greed and weakness. Dwarves, humans, elves, just festering. No order, no goal. You are one of the few I have met with any ability. And yet this too was random, a result of selfishness. I cannot fathom how a mire like this can be justified. You say we should leave, but how can you bear to stay in this chaos? I agree. It's a mess. But you don't see that as a problem? I see it as an opportunity, and I intend to take full advantage. Karisten are soldiers. The Kuhn made it so. They can never vary from that assigned path, never be other than they are meant to be. But they are free to choose within that role, to accept and succeed, or deny and die. Glory is clear and defined. It is an undeniable certainty. What full advantage can you take without that authority? He's free to choose to obey. That isn't contradictory to you. He chooses to be, as do we all, long before any of your meaningless freedoms are presented. Your kind may force our role to change, if the Kuhn demands. She was angry to see her people losing their culture by claiming yours. We accept those who submit to the Kuhn. The weak naturally seek the strong. It doesn't matter. We did not come equipped to indoctrinate. I am here to satisfy a demand you cannot understand. It's been a long time. It will take as long as needed. No ship is coming. There is no rescue from duty to the Kuhn. I am stuck here. That is not the understanding of city leaders and their... supporters. Let them rot. Filth stole from us. Not now, not the Sarkamek. Years ago. A simple act of greed has bound me. We are all denied Parvolin until I alone recover what was lost under my command. That is why this elf and her shadows are unimportant. That is why I do not simply walk from this pustule of a city. Fixing your mess is not the demand of the Kune, and you should all be grateful! Thank you, human, for your service. Leave. He's on the edge. The Viscount should know.
Some mage sent that thing here to kill him. Why would anyone... Oh, Maker. The murders. Emmerich was right. He was getting too close. He suspected a man named Gascard Dupuis. Did he do this? I killed Gascard. Then who sent the creature? Whoever did this is a dangerous apostate that Meredith will want found. I will see to it personally. My guardsmen will find Alessa, the woman who was with Gascard. She might still be in danger. Thank you for your help in this matter. If you learn anything more, please come to me. You seem very angry. And here I thought the Chantry was against mind reading. Did something happen to you in the circle? I understand there were problems. Oh, I'll stick you like a pig! In the circle of demons. No, it's not about old. Let's finish this! It's not about being beaten and raped by a Templar. That does happen. But I think it's a larger principle. Freedom every man, woman, and child born in Thedas have as a natural right. You were given to the Circle. I was given to the Chantry. Hawk was driven away from home by the Darkspawn. None of us are free. of them.
I prefer the city. It's more... ordered. You are in a strange place for... is half the battle, and it need not be wholly unprofitable. Lieutenant Harley? Aveline? Thank the Maker. I take it you know each other. Harley is one of the Guard, recently promoted. This disaster is my first routine assignment. We're not reinforcements, if that's what you're waiting for. Bollocks! Little Bedham must not have made it back. 
We're up against Evert's Marauders. You're certain about that? Fel Orden's up there, and Victor Longdeath's handiwork you've already seen. We tried two sorties up the path, but it's trapped to oblivion. Now I'd be thankful just to get out of here alive. No fair, God Dog! You've brought friends! Shut your mouth! <laughs> Fel Orden? Victor Longdeath? What are you talking about? They've been robbing and raping for Maker knows how long. Did a broad daylight assault on the keep to rescue one of their number two years back. Fel Orden, a blood mage, is here. Victor Longdeath, Sophie. Maker? You certainly drew a fine first detail. It's too dangerous for you and your men. Stay put. I'll take care of it. Look out for traps. Be careful. Evert's mortars are deadly. I don't like the looks of this. They're all dead? I... I can't believe it. I'll tell Lieutenant Jalen at the keep what you've done. I'll make sure he rewards you. Good work yourself, Lieutenant. Make sure the others know it. Men! We're heading home!
Watch your step. All set. That should do it. I don't like the looks of this. All set. We need to get closer. Up. It's too far. I found your patrol. They won't be coming back. You have stolen my duty, Basra. We were supplied for this task, but you have done this instead. Take what was meant for us. Look at all the elves. Did you misplace this?
Beats the mind. That much I know. with green, not like here. It's not a pretty home, but at least it's clean. Have you noticed how many Tranquil are in the Gallows Courtyard lately? And don't tell me I'm just sensitive to it. I've been watching, and every day there are new Tranquil, selling their bloody wares. Good mages, too. People I know pass their harrowing. Doesn't Chantry Law say that mages who pass their harrowing can't be made Tranquil? Exactly. The Templars are using the right of Tranquility to silence those who speak against them. They're working on a deliberate plan to turn every mage in Kirkwall within the next three years. Whatever you think of Templars, you can't imagine they're so heartless. They're worse. There are groups in Kirkwall who help those fleeing the Circle. I've talked to people on the inside. The plan is the work of a Templar named Sir Ulrich. I've had a run-in with him myself. He's the one who did the ritual on Karl. Nasty piece of work. Likes to make mages beg. What happened between you and Sir Ulrich? I've been involved with an... underground resistance. Mages living free in Kirkwall who help others escape. I can't tell you any more, for your sake and theirs. You have too much involvement with the Guard and nobility. Suffice it to say, I've been in the gallows. I've seen his work firsthand. What else do you know about Sir Ulrich? The Knight Commander is at least sincere in her convictions. However misguided, she believes she's helping people. Sir Ulrich's a sadist. Cold-blooded as a lizard. He likes to experiment on mages. Find out what it takes to push them into the arms of demons. Then perhaps the blame can be laid on him. And not every Templar. That's what I hope. If we bring the evidence of this plan to light, there must be men who'll stand against it. Perhaps even the Grand Cleric will finally be forced to act. My friends in the Mage Underground know a way inside. A secret entrance under the walls of the gallows. Come with me tonight, please. Help me find the evidence of Sir Ulrich's tranquil solution. I wouldn't let you face this alone. You are the one bright light in Kirkwall. I've always feared being made tranquil. Now, more than ever, I'm ready to go when you are. Our entrance is concealed not far from here.
Need to get closer. Let's finish this. Do not tell anyone about this way into the gallows. It's a secret. This is it. This tunnel will take us into the gallows. Are you ready to help me find evidence of the tranquil solution? Let's go. It would be better as open warfare. At least then, mages might get a fair fight. They're on to us, boys. Let's make sure this don't go on. <laughs> I think that's the last of them. smugglers built these tunnels to service the Templars who crave the stuff. Thank you. 
No, please. I haven't done anything wrong. That's a lie. What do we do to mages who lie? I just wanted to see my mum. No one ever told her where they were taking me. No. No, this is their place. We cannot... So, you admit your attempted escape. You know what happens to mage girls who don't toe the line around here, don't you? Please, no! Don't make me tranquil. I'll do anything. That's right. Once you're tranquil, you'll do anything I ask. Get your hands off her! You fiends will never touch a mage again! It's over, Anders. They're all dead. Every one of them will feel justice's burn. Get away from me, demon! I am no demon. Are you one of them, that you would call me such? Anders, that girl is a mage. We rescued her from being made tranquil. She is theirs. I can feel their hold on her. She's the reason you're fighting, Anders. Don't turn on her now. Please, Messer. Baker, no. I almost... If you weren't here, I... I need to get out of here.
That should... You... you saved my life, Messer. What was that thing? He's no demon. Just a deeply troubled man. Can I go home now? Sir Ulrich is gone. You'll be safest in the circle. Without Sir Ulrich, maybe Bethany's right. The circle isn't so bad. Thank you again, Messer. Food is what you can keep down. Trash. Trash. Keep. Trash. Trash. Won't be needing that anymore. This is all Sir Ulrich had. Looks like the Tranquil Solution began and ended with him. Let me see that. The Divine... rejected the idea. Meredith rejected the idea. This was... not what I expected. Perhaps I should try talking to the Grand Cleric. Maybe she's more reasonable than I thought. Thank you. I will think on what you've said. And that will, uh, stop the itch. Yes. Though I would stay away from women you meet in the port. Pirates tend to... dock in unsavory places. Just use the salve if it comes back. Uh, excuse me. Things just keep getting worse. I had Templars practically on my doorstep the other night. <laughs> Don't tell me these things. I might have to lock you up, to keep them off you. Sweetheart, I'm not letting anyone lock me up. You included. The Knight Commander is out of control. Even her own people have been talking about it. The curfews, the midnight raids on mages' families. Everyone I know forced into hiding so they won't be made tranquil. If they want you, they'll have to come through me. Just being with me puts you at risk. The Knight Commander has declared supporting apostates a hanging offense. The thought of them hurting you. Everything I've done to control this. I don't care. I would drown us in blood to keep you safe. You don't think we should start with flowers? Jewelry? If that's the man you're looking for, you're in the wrong place. There will be more violence. I know that. If you tie yourself to me, I'll only hurt you. 
Nothing would hurt as much as losing you. You don't want to do this. I have no control around you. You could have a normal life. You don't want to be with an apostate. Don't tempt me. Not unless you're ready for what that means. What are you doing? Putting out milk. I miss having a cat around. But I think the refugees have scared them all off. Or maybe eaten them. You know, I've been meaning to thank you. You don't need to stick your neck out for the mages here. But you have. One day, we'll make a world where your sister can be free again. I've always had a thing for scrappy underdogs. I've tried to hold back. You saw what I almost did to that girl. You've seen what I am. But I'm still a man. You can't tease me like this and expect me to resist forever. I don't want you to resist. <laughs> this will be a disaster. But I can't live without it. We could die tomorrow. I don't want it to be before I tell you how I feel. I've never felt this way about anyone. I thought with justice, this part of me was over. I can't give you a normal life. If you're with me, we'll be hunted, hated. The whole world will be against us. If your door is open tonight, I will come to you. If not, I'll know you took my warning at last. Meryl, I see you were meant for great things. Thank you. 
But you're stupid. I'm sorry, what? Don't you think it would be better to work on where you are now, instead of recreating old glory? No, no, that's kind of the opposite of what I've been saying. I'm the stupid one. <clears throat> Whatever. 